My name is Yuto Tanaka. I'm just a worker who belongs to society. Yeah, I can spend this weekend with my family. Let's relax at home for the first time in a long time. My family consists of my dear wife and my five-year-old daughter. My job is going well, and I'm living a very rewarding life. But it seems that the seeds of trouble are always nearby. All right, let's do this. Yeah. What is this? Is it a war? Our neighbor is having a party with her friends. There's a lot of people here. I see. What a surprise. They do that sometimes, but today's party is especially big. We are in trouble. Our neighbor is very insane. I mean, very unique person. Mr. and Mrs. Kondo are ex-gang, just as they appear. They are often visited by thug-like people. Many neighbors feel uneasy because of it. Let's start the barbecue! Woo! Enjoy the party! Tetsuji-san is the best! A few hours later. So, they've been making noise for half a day now. Daddy, they're scary. They have a daughter the same age as ours, and I'd like to be friends with them, but... They even seem to be bringing fireworks to the party. Fireworks? With that many people? Yeah, that's a lot of fireworks. I wonder if they'll be okay. I'm going to go check it out. You two stay at home. I thought it was dangerous, so I decided to go say a few words. I never thought it would turn out like that. Fireworks are beautiful! Oh, isn't it? Burn, Burn it. it! Burn, Burn it. it! Burn it! Burn it! Burn it! Kondo-san, what's this all about? Huh? You're the guy next to. You can tell by looking at it, we're having a party! You're on my property, and you don't even have enough water. What if there's a fire? I'll be careful. Feel free to party or whatever you want, but please be more moderate. Hey, hey, hey. Oh, you mean, are you jealous? Because we're always having a big luxurious party? What? A big luxurious party? From the looks of it, your car is normal and your clothes are plain. I'm thinking you don't have much money. I don't deserve to be told what to do with my lifestyle. I'm just saying it's a nuisance to your neighbors. My wife and child, they are having trouble getting up so early in the morning on their day off. Oh, yeah, yeah, don't be jealous. Be smart, neighbor. Look, I'm proud of my friends for fighting. It's better to be friendly with us, right? <laughs> That's right. We've been in a lot of fights since we were in school. I see. So you're threatening me. No, no, not at all. It's just a matter of adaptability, I guess. It's better to follow what stronger people say if you are an adult, right? If that's what you value, then I'll respect it. Oh, you understand. Then, since you're here, why don't you give up your garden and... Hello? How many can come now? Oh well, that's good enough. Come over here right now. Hey, where are you calling? You'll find out soon enough. Hi, we are here. What? Hey, do you know these guys? You called too many of them. I don't know those guys. No, wait. You're early as usual. It's been a while, President. You mean ex-president. For us, you are and always have been the only president. Oh, dear. What? Who is that guy? Could it be? Is that Kiaraman? Kiaraman, you mean the legendary biker gang? They united the rough and tumble of the neighborhood and brought peace to the area. I think the president's name was Tanaka. No way. You said it is wise to follow the strong one, is it not? What do you think we should do now? If we follow your rule. <laughs> I am sorry. I will never bother you again. I promise. Well, I guess we'll see about that. But I don't condone today's barbecue. Where's the stuff? Hey, the oil drums are over here. Okay, great. D -d -d drum Don't tell me there's concrete in there too. 
Am I going to be buried and thrown in Tokyo Bay? Oh, no. I'm sorry. Please don't do this. I have a wife and daughter. I know that. That's why it's a drum. It's big, isn't it? Oh, no. <sighs> what is with that kid's barbecue? Please don't throw me in Tokyo Bay, huh? Hey, get the stove drums ready. Yes. You already called the fire department. Of course we did. What about the neighbors? We've called them. Oh, um, what's this? Cheap meat, cheap booze, tiny wire mesh, and a crappy charcoal. You are not college kids. But isn't that what barbecue is all about? You don't get it. You don't understand anything. Watch me. I'll teach you how to barbecue like an adult. From then on, I had the whole place to myself. Grum stove is ready. The meat has been prepped. Let the grilling begin. Hey, lumps of meat are coming in. Whoa, I've never seen meat that big. Is that what the drums are for? I got some good stuff from the wine cellar downstairs. A wine cellar in the basement? There is such a thing? Good wine needs good storage. We added it when we bought the house. You spend money like a rich man. I thought you were just an office worker. What are you talking about? He used to be the president of Kiaraman, and now he is the president of the company he founded with those executives. President? Our team is known for its fighting prowess, but we were originally more of a moderate group. We were just too strong and there were always challengers. We usually had barbecues on the riverbanks. Oh, I see. And now he is the president of the company. We're proud of him too. That doesn't matter now. We are all equal in front of the meat. Whoa! This is meat cooked in a drum. What an appetizing smell. Are we going to bite into this? No. You just have to cut it and mix it with a special sauce. Yum. Eat it with homemade pickles and crispy bread. That's absolutely delicious. Marinade and salad are ready. Drinks are here. There are snacks too. Okay, we're all here. Now let's start the barbecue. Eat till you're full. Thanks for the food. Thank you for the meal. Thus began the barbecue for adults. Yum! It's completely different from our meat. The ingredients in cooking are on another level. I've never had such good sake before. Yes, this is real barbecue. Isn't the meat my dad cooked delicious? It is. Let's do it again. Yes, I'll definitely do it. Is it okay, Dad? Yeah, of course. Kids are strong. They get along easily. I wish we could all be like that as an adult. Well, I'm really sorry. I'm sorry for all the trouble I've caused you and thank you for treating us like this. That's all right. From now on, let's be friendly with each other as neighbors. I look forward to it. This is how the Kondo family changed their attitude. They still have barbecues often, but it's a good gathering with moderation. It's important to take care of your friends. Yes, that's right. Friends who have been with you since school are very valuable. I understand. And now let me tell you something. I'm thinking of building a pizza oven. <laughs> well, that's interesting. I'm thinking of building it with bricks and burning wood inside. I was wondering if you could give me some advice. Okay, let's have a drink inside and talk about it in detail. Dad, I want to go too. She says that, but is it okay? Yeah, my daughter would like to meet her too. Thank you very much. It's nice to have friends of her own age. It's my pleasure. So, first of all, the size of the pizza oven. Well, the area where the optimum temperature is reached is surprisingly small, so we have to calculate that. I see. That's great. Let's have a pizza party together when it's finished. Oh, I'm looking forward to it. I know it was an unexpected neighborhood problem, but I'm sure our life will be much more fulfilling from now on. <laughs>